Today we're going to take a look at the Peterson backup alarm for trucks and vans. Anytime you have a fleet vehicle or maybe a commercial vehicle, you need to replace the alarm on the back or just upgrade a vehicle that doesn't already have one, this is going to be a great alarm for that use. It's going to have a decibel level of 110 decibels and it's going to allow people to know that we're throwing our vehicle into reverse and they should stand clear. Comes with the grommet that you see already attached. Fits into a four and a half inch cutout. So you will have to have a cutout to get this installed. You can install it horizontally or vertically. Without the grommet in place, our diameter is about four and a quarter inches across. Overall, it's about one and three quarters inches deep. And going from the inside portion here, it's about an inch, maybe an inch and an eighth, or an inch and a sixteenth deep. This meets all SAE J994 Type F specifications. Has an operating voltage between 12 and 24 volts. And go ahead and demonstrate how loud this is going to be. We just have our two wires to connect. We'll have our ground wire, you want to connect that to a good chassis ground, and then the red wire will be our power wire. Now this you'll want to connect in with the reverse light sw switch on your vehicle. If you don't have backup lights or reverse lights on your vehicle, you'll have to put a switch in place on your own. That switch is not included with this, so you will have to pick one up separately. Connect our wires here. And if you're listening to this video with headphones, I would advise turning your volume down so this doesn't deafen you because it's very, very loud. And there you go. That's going to be that decibel level of 102. So it'll let people know that you're throwing the vehicle into reverse and they should stand clear. And that's going to do it for our look at the Peterson backup alarm for trucks and vans.